Thank you. My name is Don Hansen, and for my Stackathon project, I attempted to build a tower defense game. Um, so I've never really built a complex game, and the purpose of this project was to really understand game logic. So I wouldn't recommend this, but I decided to only use React and Redux, not even Canvas to do the animations. A lot of challenges that came with that. Um, going forward, I would definitely want to try this with Canvas. But uh, I think one of the biggest challenges is because I wasn't using Canvas, I started out with trying to constantly manipulate the DOM over and over and over, and it's expensive. And I found that out very quickly with just like two figures moving across the screen. So I thought React would be very efficient with that. It is, but DOM manipulation is just very expensive. That was a learning lesson. So then I kind of switched to CSS um, transitions. So that helped the uh, animation become a little bit smoother. But the next challenge was I wanted to update the game logic and separate it from the CSS animation so I could give just uh, basically uh, give the transition a start point and an end point, giving an amount of time to make that transition, and then kind of do my best to match it up with everything that was updating in the state. So tons of challenges that came with that. So there are going to be a couple features that work. We'll go ahead and give it a try. Uh, but going into this, I'm really glad I did it this way. I really learned how efficient Redux and React is. Um, I also really got to understand game logic. So I'm really excited to build my next game in a little bit slightly different version. So let's go ahead and get started. Um, yeah, let's, let's just go ahead and get started. I did have a song. It's not working. <laughs> so I was trying to build projectiles and kind of just, I actually have a collision system in the back working. Animations are not working. And so they're getting ready to shoot right now, and they're actually doing it in React and Redux. And then there's the animation. It's just not repeating. So a lot is working in the background, and I got the animations to flow smoothly. It was really fun, and it took a lot of time to figure out how to do that. But um, yeah, I actually had a lot of fun with this project. And now that everything's kind of in place, um, my, my project is actually set up to build more levels at this point. Like there's a whole um, path function that will actually let me design all my levels as well. But yeah, it's, it's very tricky mixing these animations with the game logic. So going forward into it, I highly suggest you use Canvas. Take advantage of a game library. React and Redux is fast, but DOM manipulation isn't. So that's kind of my lesson for this project. <laughs> Thank you.